when you get that diagnosis, you're, you know, devastated. You go through a range of emotions. Um, you want to get a second, third, fourth, tenth opinion. We really wanted some answers on what do we do now. Instead of blaming or trying to figure out how this happened, ultimately all you want to do is do the best for your child. When their child is first diagnosed with autism, it's really a very troubling time for the parents. The approach that we have here at the Verbal Behavior Center for Autism is a verbal behavior approach. And what verbal behavior focuses on is specifically looking at ways that we can get children to communicate with us. We will sit down with parents when, when their children first start in the program and we will identify the areas that the parents have of concern for their children and then we'll communicate with the parents the areas that we see as areas for concern for the children. Each child here is working one-on-one -on -one with a very well-educated therapist all day long and they also have a consultant that works with them. Our consultants are board certified behavior analysts and they give even more focus to each of the children's programs. That child's team will meet weekly to discuss the child's progress and identify areas where we need to continually work on. When I read that it was, you know, one-on-one -on -one therapy, I thought there's no way we can afford it. Then I talked to a friend who I had met who she had her son here and she told me it was very reasonable by the time the insurance picked up most of the cost. They were wonderful. They put us right in contact with the person. The cost is minimal compared to what what we thought we were going to have to find a way to pay for. Each child here has their own therapy room where they work individually with their therapist. So they have an entire room that's completely dedicated to them and all of their things. You know, you can bring things into that room to make it comfortable for, for your child. All the socialization that they get um, throughout the day as well as the one-on-one -on -one therapy, that's very important. It's bright, it's vibrant, it's, it's wonderful in here. ABA, which stands for Applied Behavior Analysis, is a teaching method that has over 30 years of research and literature decreasing inappropriate behaviors and increasing appropriate behaviors such as communication and social skills. It takes time, but it does work. It's one of the few proven treatments for autism. By having those one-on-one -on -one therapists who are trained in you know, ABA, and they chart all his progress and they work toward all these goals. I like that it's so structured. The children really don't even realize that they're learning because they're having so much fun with their therapist. We're able to come in anytime we want to here. We're able to watch their therapy. We have monthly meetings with them. When I have had suggestions, um, they're just very receptive to that, you know, and they listen to me and, and they think, I think they understand that as a parent, you do know your child best, and, and so it's really like a team approach. He loves his therapist. He jumps out of the car when we get here. He's ready to go. He loves coming to school every day when I drop him off. He's a lot better today, you know, than even four months ago in terms of interacting with us. Just in the short time that he's been here, he has made strides unbelievable strides. He's done fabulous. The VBCA has helped us tremendously at home.